Hello, I'm Tim Heyer, Tulare County Superintendent of Schools, here with another update about schools in Tulare County. As of today, nearly all schools in our county have started back in one form or another. Most are operating a distance learning model, which simply means students and teachers are in different places during instruction. I know this has presented many challenges, and I believe educators countywide agree this is not the best way for our students to learn. Until we receive the green light for in-person instruction from the state capitol, I trust that you are doing your best to overcome the challenges and assist our students with their education. On Tuesday, August 25th, the California Department of Public Health released additional guidelines that allow specific groups of students to return to campus for targeted intervention and special services. Each local school district will review existing legal requirements and student data to identify which students will be invited back to campus to receive these services. The guidelines restrict the number of students to groups of 14 or less and suggest that no more than 25% of the total school enrollment be allowed on campus at any time. The current mandates regarding six feet of social distancing, wearing face coverings, and keeping the same students together without intermingling must still be followed. I think this is a step in the right direction and will continue to advocate for more students returning to school as long as we can maintain their safety and the safety of our staff. If you would like more details about how these new guidelines will affect your child's school, please contact their school or district directly. I'm encouraged to see the number of positive cases in Tulare County begin to fall. While that's good news, let's not neglect our duty to wear face masks and social distance at all times. Until next time, stay safe and support one another.